This the scene at 3.15 a.m. yesterday morning when the Thunder arrived on their charter flight back to Oklahoma City following a game five loss in Oakland. Over 600 fans showing up. And this, the scene tonight here at Chesapeake Energy Arena, Santa Claus. And of that 18,000 turning out for Game 6 of the Western Conference Final, the defending NBA champion Golden State Warriors facing the Oklahoma City Thunder. OKC in front, three games to two, a win, and Curry Harris Thompson for three. If you're a Warriors fan, you love seeing that Thompson not shooting great in this series. Here's Thompson, got the step, scores. Beautifully done. And Billy Donovan wants the call. Timeout call on Thompson, who scores. Nice move, he's able to protect it. The Durant, his first. A three-pointer for Craig Thompson. He's mumbling, he's probably saying, finally. He just is not comfortable. Thompson, yes, another three for Clay Thompson. Clay Thompson's always comfortable. Whether he's making it or missing it behind that three-point line, knocking it down. Now that 19-point third-quarter explosion back in, in game four. Thompson wide open for three. Clay Thompson shooting them back into it. The Warriors now within four. That's his fourth from downtown. He's four of eight after the slow start. From beyond that three-point line, here is Thompson has been on fire, and he hits again. Clay Thompson, his fifth three-pointer. When the ball slows down, Mark. All right, here is Thompson again. Clay Thompson has given the Warriors a one-point lead. We heard Charles Barkley talk about how here's Thompson who just checked back in and knocks out a three. Now, will this be the final 12 minutes? Thompson, a rainbow three. Clay Thompson with his eighth three-pointer, the playoff record for threes made. He is shooting these shots, fading away, catching them. He's making them before he even lets it go. Thompson said, this is not over. Over. Keeping it alive for the new possession. Thompson turning and shooting. What a shot by Clay Thompson. He is putting on a tough Difficult three-point shot exhibition. That's all heart and will. He's challenging himself. He doesn't want to go home unless it's to play game seven. 31 points for Thompson. Nine of 50 at Westbrook. He lost it. It'll be Golden State ball. There was no foul call. Now, wait a second. Boulder pointing off the drive. Play Thompson who has had a terrific night, 33 points, a long three for Thompson, and that is an NBA record, his 10th three-pointer of the night. It's an NBA playoff record for Clay Thompson. Thompson fires for three, yes! Golden State by three. And just... Like that, Golden State has momentum on their side. A minute 25 to go, Durant for three, rushed it. And here comes Golden State. This crowd is shocked. I think the players are as well, they're taking. The Durant came from out of bounds and they turn it over. And Curry just runs it out. And that will do it in one of the shockers in terms of a come from behind effort that we have seen in the playoffs. Thanks very much, Marv. Clay, you told your coach after game five you don't want to go home. And you may, you definitely didn't want to go home tonight. None of us did, and uh, I was just so proud of everybody, man. We were down almost the whole game, and we never gave up, and just our resiliency paid off in the end. Steph, what was the key to winning those last six minutes when you guys were down? It was about time we had a stretch in this building that uh, you know, we imposed our will. And I mean, we got stops. Clay hit some amazing shots. Uh, kept you know our composure. Draymond, huge play on that steal. I mean, we just knew uh, you know if we didn't get it done, we we're going home. So it was a big win. Clay, I know you're a great shooter, and obviously Steph's a great shooter as well. But 
the shots you were taking tonight, it was like you were barely touching the ball and it was going up. Just describe being in a rhythm like that. I didn't start off the game right, right? and I knew uh, we're not going to go far if I'm not being aggressive. And it opens up the floor for everybody. So I was just using my teammates, being patient, believe it or not, and just never letting my you know, confidence waver because I'm ineffective when I'm not out there hunting my shot. Steph, for the last previous two games, I could barely hear myself think. Now it's pretty quiet in here, and you held up seven fingers. What do you imagine game seven is going to be like now that you got it back home? Uh, it's gonna be fun, I know. I know I said this game was probably the hardest of our lives, but now that we've got this under our belt, um, we can't just assume because we're going home and it's game seven, we can just show up. We have to bring that same energy, same focus, uh, you know, activity that we had tonight and take care of business at home. So we got a, we got a great opportunity.